Hey, I just want to apologize ahead of time. The first like 10 seconds of this video, the audio and video were a little choppy. But after that, it's all good. Okay, so I want to show how I make all my caps here on Fallout 4. You may have seen this before if you've played a lot of Fallout. You probably know about this. But if it's something new to you, I'm glad you learned something. I'm able to buy all these power armors, tons of ammo for all my guns. So we got full ammo, basically infinite ammo at this point. We are pretty loaded. So, got my sniper rifle. Basically, I just go buying all the ammo up. That way you don't ever have to worry about it. And of course, you can buy stim packs and all that good stuff. Well, we'll get the pistol out and we'll put that away for now. We'll go downstairs. Say what's up. What you need? Hey, yo, what up? Okay. So, basically, it's all about water. You want to have lots of water. If you go in here, every day or so, I think it's about every day or two, this will respawn in here. But if you're in the location of the settlement uh, for too long, it won't respawn. You actually have to be out and about doing things for the water to respawn. And you can take it out. We'll say all 400. And if I want to go over here to my weapon stealer, he's always got some good ammo for me. Hi. I'm sure I've got something you need. I'm sure you do. Sure. So we're going to barter with him. Here's what I've got. And let's just say we want tons of 10 millimeter. He usually has, um, let's see, we'll go just to ammo. He's got shotgun shells. And let's say we want to get. 308, you know, just, uh, we want to make sure we're not giving them money, so what you do is you go down to your aid here, and you want to go to purified water. We can get 4,000 caps from them, but I think, like, say we wanted to, we could just go over and buy everything that we wanted till it was evened up. We still want to be able to make some caps from them, too. So, like, let's see, we'll just, you know, Fusion cell. He usually has fusion cores, but it doesn't look like he has any right now. So sometimes he'll spawn with those, which is really cool. That's how I was able to get hundreds of those. Actually, I think I have a little over 100. Let's say 50 caliber. You can probably buy all of his ammo and still make some money. So there it is. We bought all of his ammo. And then we're just going to press OK. And we bought all of his ammo and made some money. So basically, obviously, like I said, with the water, I have 582 water. Go in the back and show you back here. I'm sprint back there. Save a little time. Now this is nothing too special. I don't work. Uh, I'm making the water plant look too pretty, but it's basically what it is. You just build all these power uh, power generators. Eventually you'll have uh, these big ones, which is nice. I probably don't even need these, but I build them anyways. Those were my first two, and then of course I was able to get this. Yeah, I love the fusion generator. I got the tire splish splashing over there. Basically you get all these water and you attach all the um, wires to them. And you get mad water, and these help a lot obviously because once you get to the point where I'm at there's a maximum now you're able to build the uh, water plants like these water purifiers you're only able to build a certain amount if you watch the water up there it's 582 plant this down wire wire boom it's power it should produce 10 but it produces none it I have 582 still so we'll store it you can still see 582 try it again just for a show boom and should give me 10 more but they've patched it out a while back so you can't infinitely do that to basically uh, cheese it but you can build these the water pumps and if you notice it'll go up slightly uh, it takes forever and these take up quite a bit of room so but you can use these and if you see we'll probably go over six uh, 591 there, so that's pretty cool. Eventually, I thought 600 would be a cool number. I try not to go too far because basically at the point to where we have tons of money, 
Eh. There were 600 even. And that's pretty much how I do that there. Very good way to make caps. You can get tons and tons of money that way. It's great for when you want to go buy power armor. I'll show you back here. That's how I make all my money for the power armor pieces and the frames themselves. So I got some in there. You might have seen them on my way out. I'll show you in here. And it's a good way to get materials without, you know, because I'm not a big fan of glitches. So I don't like duplicate things. I don't like to do mods and stuff like that. I try to keep it vanilla. Oh, it's upstairs. Huh? Where'd it go? Come back down. Of course, this I. You can't build these, so you can just uh, take it from one of the houses that's sitting in there. And I just threw it in here. It can explode, so careful of that. We don't want to go to the third floor, we'll go to the second floor. And that's pretty much how I buy a lot of my armor, a lot of my materials for it. Because what you can do with your money is say, I'll go back down real quick. That's why my elevator gets stuck up there. I kind of jump down a lot of the time. But there's all sorts of traders around them, the world that will sell you. Ain't looking for trouble. Oh. I hope. Okay. Not looking for any trouble, but. Excuse me. Looking to buy. So there's a bunch of traders around Let's the world that will have um, shipments. Like. You want to take these shipments. You have. Uh, we'll go down here to. I think it's all the way down. Oh, there we go. We got shipments of ceramic, concrete, copper, rubber, steel, wood. And you can buy those and get tons of materials. And if you're looking for certain ones, you just Google who has shipments and you can go buy them from them. Like there's guys in Diamond City that sell some. Uh, Diamond City is a good place for them. So if you want to go down to Diamond City, go here. There's some si people that sell shipments there. And... All around the map you'll find people that will sell them. Mostly the general goods people will sell tons of shipments. It's a good way to get materials without duplicating stuff. Because like I said, I'm not a big fan of that. Also you can farm too, because you will get your mute fruit. Can we grab that from in here? Hmm. And you can get those too. Basically, and you get your caps in there from your stores, so grab those. And that, all my extra mute fruit and water I'll just store in here because uh, you don't want it to weigh you down. So we'll just store that real quick. We have thousands of water and a few thousand mute fruit. But yeah, that's basically it for now. Hopefully if you've never seen that before, you're able to use that and make some extra caps. Um, if you're still playing Fallout 4, I still play it from time to time. I enjoy building a lot, as you can notice. There's a few buildings here. I'm going to be working on a new one that's just basically all power armor, since that spot's in there is full, and my power armor room in there is full. So. If you work, you eat. Yeah. It's as simple as that. All right. Well, I hope you liked this video. If you did, leave it a like. Uh, dislike it if you want, but no one's going to see it. So, thanks a lot for watching. Got a dangerous look about you. Hope you ain't here for me.